Congratulations, my dear. Your dreams are already starting to come true. The next step is to perform a ritual and get an amulet at one of our seminars. After that, all your problems will disappear from your life forever. Register and check it out. Namaste, my dear. You see, I greeted you and immediately the spirits of the wind responded, also greeting you. Everything in this world is alive. You just need to turn to them and they respond immediately. Now the wind does not calm down. He says, I am here. I hear. If you need power, always turn to the power of nature, to the power of the elements, to the power of Mother Earth. Today, you and I will do a lesson on the power of our voice. Because when we need something, we say it, ask about it, or don't say it and clamp it inside of us. Sometimes we want to say something or shout something about how we feel, but we suppress it within ourselves. And there is a blockage of energy in your heart and throat. And then you want to do something creative. Start dancing, singing, writing poetry, and declare some of your results in life. But once, and everything is blocked. Maybe it's your karmic situation. Dear, we are women, and we can heal with our voice. We can inspire with our voices, and with all these talents of our soul. With the help of the voice, we can offend the person. So women have always been very attentive to how, what, and to whom they apply. Think of yourself as a little girl. Even now, you are a grown woman. And when you are praised and say a kind word, everything blossoms inside with a flower of love. And if somehow someone looks at you unkindly or still says some offensive word, then the flower of love closes immediately. So remember, that your words and the state of your voice depends a lot. Today, we will use voice magic to heal because we, women, are able to heal ourselves with the sound of a drum, with the help of a kulmus, with the help of a dance, and with the help of a voice. You and I have so many magical tools to make our life and the life of our lineage so full, so healthy, so that the lineage will be so prosperous, that your loved ones will come and say, we thank you. Thank you for being with us. What a blessing that you take care of everything. Dear, we must understand that we are given a voice to rejoice, laugh, say the words of love, or even shout sometimes to say that there is danger somewhere. But today, we will awaken the power of the voice through the energy of the uterus. Ready? So, sit comfortably. Preferably with crossed legs as I sit, so you have comfortable support so that you can easily move right, left, forward, and backward. If you sit uncomfortably, then find a support point behind your back. Maybe it will be a wall, a chair, very good. And now... Just close your eyes now. The birds are singing beautifully in my area. I give you this beauty. This is a state of harmony. Feel it. All your attention plunges into yourself, into your uterus. How much energy there is, how much strength there is. 
And right now, we're going to move that force along the spine and say it through our voice. Let's practice doing it just through sounds. So, let's say a sound. A. Easy? I also think it's easy. Okay, let's inhale towards the uterus. Close your eyes and fix your attention on what's happening in your body. If you feel like there's an energy pipe inside you that's making that sound, that's fine. If it doesn't happen, we'll train with you again and again. So let's make one more sound and feel the energy rising through your voice. Okay, take a breath. I already feel like you're doing it, and you're doing it so much better. Do you get to feel your power? We will practice with you releasing your natural voice. So now that you and I have prepared ourselves a little bit, we will now sing healing mantras at each energy center. At the same time, we will concentrate on it and heal a certain internal organ or the whole system. Check your spine. The top reaches out to the sky and the coccyx reaches out to the ground. You seem to have stretched out on the threads. The top stretches upwards and the coccyx down. So, concentration is in the uterus. And the first words of power that we will sing with you. This is the mantra of the physical body. This is the mantra, Lam. And when you sing, feel the energy in the coccyx region opening and rising with a strong voice. You heal the whole body. Let's start doing female magic. Let's take a breath. Let's shift our attention to the Sacred Women's Center and sing the next sound of power, you. And we can feel the energy awakening in the uterus, your feminine force sacred. Let's take a breath. All attention to the solar plexus, and here we will heal our lineage, heal the power of the lineage, and give energy for the prosperity of a lineage. And here is the mantra, Ram. Let's tune into this energy of fire and power.
I feel that it has become very hot. It's hot here, and the gastrointestinal tract is healing. We tune into our heart center, to the power of our love, and the healing of the cardiovascular and respiratory systems. And here is our mantra, YAM. Let's take a breath. We shift our attention to the sacral throat center, to the center of creativity, and we will begin to heal the thyroid, parathyroid, ligaments, tonsils, and tonsils. And here is the mantra, HUM. Let's take another breath and shift all the attention to the interbrow area. Here we will concentrate on the karma that is in our family. All karmic situations of your past lives, lives of your lineage. And here is the mantra, Om. Let's take a breath. Pull all of your attention on top of your head, a center that communicates with the higher forces, with the blessings of the higher spirits and gods. Feel how now you and I are opening this flow because of the power of your voice. And now we shall sing the sacred sound, Am, the sound of the creation of the whole universe, and therefore a new destiny for you and your family. Let's take a breath. If your eyes have been open, close them. Tune into your inner state. Feel the state of vitality, energy, and health. Feel your dense aura. Now take a deep breath and exhale. Open your eyes if they were closed. Now when you are filled with vitality and energy, only then will you begin to do your important things in life. Without energy, nothing can be done. Imagine you have no life force. You have no energy to be noticed by good people. Of course, they can't see you, but now, in this state, in the state of activation, your aura glows and you become visible to the good spirits who are always near and want to help you. Only when filled with energy, go ahead and do all your important things. Do not start any business in a weak state where you think it will not work. Only bold, strong energy states will help you achieve all your goals in life. If you want to realize your wishes very quickly, then contact me. You and I will turn to the strongest spirits 
and do a shamanic ritual for good luck. And then your wish, right from heaven, from the world of the future, will incarnate on earth. In fact, being happy is very easy. And if you don't believe me, come to my seminars, come to my retreats, where there are only women, because women have a special energy path. We get together with women, and we create protective rituals for our families, for our cities, for our countries, and for the world. I know if you're watching me, it means you're the woman I was meant to meet at my seminar to impart ancient wisdom from heart to heart. It takes energy and a woman's power to cope with life's problems. My dear, we are ready to share it with you. Buy your amulets and connect to the source of well-being and good luck. See you soon.